Hello, people. This is Eric Cobra. And Ron and Arja. Hold on, one. And Kimania. <laughs> and this is Let's Play with Sigma Blind. Last time we helped Moses and his bro. Well, uh, more like we, they helped us, to be honest. So we can uh, help Okay, you. I'll join in. Yeah. Also, by the way, Rana, Eagle Scrooge says, don't be embarrassed of making a dirty joke, even unintentional. Like, just embrace it. Yeah, I will try, but then again, you know me. Yes. Also, uh, anyway, also Eagle Scrooge w wants to know just how many mythologies are pumped into this game. The answer is, we have no freaking clue. We keep finding more and more involved in this. Well, so far we have something with Vikings, something with Phil, something with Egyptians. Well, uh, let's just say we have... Fantasy. Yeah. Oh, we... uh, wait, Judaism, we haven't really run into Jesus yet. Um, but we do at least know that some uh, that the Old Testament is in play, so... We got the... that. Uh, yeah. We have the Nordic gods, and yeah. we have the... Uh, well... The Mayans were there too. Yeah. Um, now we have Egyptian mythology, both the, you know, re uh, normal religion and the whole Akhenaten thing, and yeah, that's a lot involved, and we keep finding more and more. So that should be interesting. In any case, um, dialogue with this um, chick. Let's this see. Two chick, yeah. Yeah. So we we'll first ask about herself. Ready? Yep. yep. Ready. Click. I'm just a soldier. I'm nobody important. Same as my crew. We go where they tell us to go. We follow orders. We shut the fuck up. Huh. Okay. I'm wrong. Working for Orochi is the best job I've ever had. Okay. Mm. Was. There's nothing best about it now. Thing is, oh. this detail, hmm. security for the Prometheus Initiative, always felt vague. Like there was something going on that we weren't privy to. It's not unusual. We're just ten soldiers lined up in a row to protect VIP personnel, but... You couldn't help but overhear things. The whispered conversations, the covert messages, the looks they gave us like we were just in the way. Vague isn't the right word. Rotten. It felt rotten. So there you have it, Ronald. These people are just common grunts hired to look strong and stand in the way of the important people. Well, uh, yeah, again, the whole hire thing, but... Yeah. So I don't think it will be fair to be hard on them. Yeah, okay, I can see that that is not fair, but I'm just skeptic of Orochi as a whole, so that's... Well, of course you are. You have been given some insight into the operating method, but do remember Orochi is this big thing divided into several cells and businesses. Yeah, These and people I, have no clue what's going on. Yeah, and I try not to uh, let the whole thing about... Uh, Ooh, they have positively some evil attentions cloud my judgment. I'm just trying to judge per individual. And that's the best way to do this. In this case, this lady doesn't seem like she's responsible for a whole lot. Mm. So I'll give her a pass. In any case, we're gonna, let's ask her about her... her, her the Orochi group. group. Yeah. Ready? Yep. Yeah. Ready. Click. I don't know what to tell you. Orochi isn't a bad place to work. Not at all. The pay is good, the benefits better, the food is spectacular. Of course, down here, we've been working with the Prometheus Initiative. Still Orochi, but not quite. Like one of those bastard familiars going through the motions, pretending to be human. Does that make sense? Not I really. Not to me either. Hmm. I don't know what it is about this. I'm good. Planet, but I had a bad, bad feeling from the start. I don't know what to tell you. Oh, whoops. I tend to click that thing again. again. So, it's not just a bad feeling, it's a bad, bad feeling. Indeed. I'm sure it's not a bad, bad, bad feeling. That is usually when some deity descends or, you know, rises up and wants to eat your face. Where have we been there? Yeah. So... Been there, done that. <laughs> so, there was something strange about the Prometheus Initiative, and just the name itself, just, just for boating. Anyway, let's ask her about her work. Ready? Yep. Yeah. Yep. Right. Click. You folks seem to be okay. I don't have a beef with any of you. Hmm, thanks. Don't get me wrong, but we're not best buds. Fair enough. Yeah. My guys here, they're the ones I'm responsible for. Their lives are in my hands, so I'm going to do what needs doing to keep them safe. Respectable. Yep. Uh -huh. in this hellhole can go to, well, hell. I don't trust anyone. Been there. Old guy in rags. Don't trust him. 
those Brit archaeologists don't trust them neither. Well, I'm nice the enough. Village, that's for sure. Mm. Who knows what kind of agenda they have? Better safe than sorry, I say. All right. Well, I guess a little bit of a little bit of healthy paranoia helps a lot in this business. Hey, it's not paranoia if people really are out to get you. And yeah. there's and there's a lot of people out to get people in this business. Yep. Yeah. Also, the whole thing about yeah, I I can actually respect her integrity as a leader for these soldiers, but yeah. Not really reaching a hand out is both a good but also a little rude gesture, but yeah. at least he cares about her troops. Yeah, and hey, we're allowed to be here, and we, she's willing to talk with us and, and that, and we can stay here and be safe and such. It's not like she's kicking us out. Mm. She just doesn't trust us, and, you know, all things considered, isn't that fair enough? That is uh, fair. I mean, I'm from the Illuminati, and... Yeah, uh, I don't think I really need to add anything to that. Th then we have two guys from the Ceiling Fan Society. And then we have the Templars who love to come in and tell everybody else how to behave because they know better. So a bit of caution is probably only healthy. Yeah, only thing I can have to say is about being a Templar. I might get some bad feelings from people, but I'm not shutting in sword first. No, and that's the good thing. And it's just like I'm not the diabolical puppet master. Because, you know, I'm not diabolical. <laughs> but still, caution is okay. Just like we were cautious about them because they were Orochi. Mm. True. Now, let's ask about the secret world. Yeah. Ready. Click. One of the first things they teach you when you get hired at Orochi is that everything is true. Everything. Huh? Ghosts? Mm? Check. Vampires? Uh-huh. Zombies? Oh, you betcha. We fought two out of those three. Think about mummies, but, you know, mummies. They plenty of to teach those two. simple magics, hmm. the kind that us normals can do without your DNA. None of the fancy stuff, but I never had the knack for it. I can maybe infuse a bullet with some intelligence, get it to go for the brainstem, but that's it. Well, that's not enough. Once I found out about the secret world, it made sense. Everything finally made sense. I'm happy with that. Hmm. Seriously, being able to infuse a bullet with enough intelligence to go for a specific body part? Yeah, but that's just, but think about it this way. Considering what we've been fighting against, that doesn't give you an advantage. That just, you know, makes the playing field equal at best. Mm, yeah. True. Right. The Super Society, is everyone ready? Yeah. Yep. Ready. Click. Look, I don't care about the clubs that you people belong to. Your little all smiles above the table, drawn knives beneath blah blah amateur drama. It really hmm. is sort of silly, don't you think? Sometimes. Way, I know. Yep. The rules of engagement for your so-called secret war. I don't know. Boys will be boys and girls? Well, they'll do whatever the boys tell them to do, I guess. Mm. The YouTube videos are hilarious. We used to watch them in the rec room during lunch back at HQ. And laugh. You ever hear about live action role playing? That's oh, what? To a T. Yeah, I guess I can kind of see why it would look like that. <laughs> what do the costumes and the over top dialogue and the general aura of nerd? Yeah, but we're not really wearing costumes any of us. No, no, we aren't right now. I am. Uh, yeah, you are, and Rana is, and. I am this sometimes. is a uh, formal suit. Yeah. The entire Rochi group is. I can see what she means. But you yeah. almost kind of stand out. Yeah. In any case, let's ask, get some quests from her. We start with a Prometheus initiative. The Orochi camp nearby has been overrun with filth. Investigate the site and the Orochi operation there might uncover interesting information. Hmm, sounds fair enough. Everyone ready? Yeah. Ready. Yep. Three, two, one, click. So let's see what we can learn about this whole business. A drink? Hmm. I guess you have to keep yourself hydrated. Thank oh, you. Thanks! Prometheus Initiative. They hmm? know how to take care of their own. Water, food, ammo. There's even a crate of scotch. Oak aged. First class. Oh, stuff. neat. That wasn't for us, obviously. <laughs> we were just here to provide protection, like good little Rochi tin soldiers, while the suits and white coats called the shots and reaped the benefits. 
We didn't ask questions. And now, we're left without answers. Mm. We don't even know what the Prometheus Initiative was doing out here. There is... was a depot close by. It's where a lot of the logistics were handled, away from prying eyes. Flying supplies in and the other stuff out, always under the cover of night. It was also the first place to get hit when the hitting began. Mm. We lost a lot of good soldiers that day. Some suits, too. But who keeps count? <laughs> We've gone in there to restock, but it's lethal. The place is crawling. And now you want us to do it. I'm a loyal employee mm. to a point, and they're pushing that point. Oh. Where's our backup? Our transportation? There's been no word, no info, no intel, nothing. Seems I'm not even sure they're playing an evac. Mm. It's strange the way it happened. Like they knew exactly when and where to hit us. Yeah, they is suspicious, all, all right. The hallmarks of an inside job. Mm. And whoever hit us, they're still around. And they have resources. So much for job security. <clears throat> you guys hiring? <laughs> I, don't I don't know, know if Dragon is hiring, but... Um... But seriously, think about it. Being a soldier and... Again, loyalty is very valuable in a soldier. And having her limits pushed as for how loyal she can be, I'm beginning to pity her. Yeah. I mean, she is just an employee with a limited view. So, yeah. I like... I... 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 I've understand... I have sympathy for her, what is what I'm trying to say if I could speak now. Oh, here is past the ammunition. The Roach's ammunition crates are running low. Look for full crates of ammunition in the area. Exactly. Sure. Might as well. We can do that. It's and there's an inactive Orochi drone over here. Yeah, let's do it. Droning on and on. <laughs> Lisa Hui's drone led you here. Ba, 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 ba. It seems that reaching the camp has updated the drone's re recon coordinates. What could be its next destination? All right, everyone ready? Yeah, yep. ready. Ready. Okay, so let's start with following this thing since it's right here. Hey, come back here! It still says activate the drone for me. But do it! Activate it! Trying. You can just follow up on us. Uh, now it is... Oh. Wait, wait. Come on. Activate your dumb drone. There we go. Oh crap. Scorpion. Not one of those sparring sandstorms. Well, I think this time the drone is assisting in the defense. I'm coming. As they said, it's got an upgrade. Not that it lasted long, but hey, I think I can fix that. There. That will be for you. Follow the drone to its destination. Oh, oh dear. I didn't see that thing. Oh, Scorpius. You never see him coming. Nice. Where did the drone go? Oh, where did the drone go? There! There! Where I see it! Where did the drone go? Gotta hurry! At the way to offer it. Hurrying! Hurrying! 